As the SAS Web Administrator, you have the ability to modify the SAS Web Report Studio banner at the top of the Web Report Studio application. The first step in making this customization is to go to the installation directory where SAS Web Report Studio is installed. You'll see I've already moved to SAS, SAS Web Report Studio 3.1, and then went to the Customer folder. At this point, you'll want to make a copy of the local properties into the same location and modify the file name so it's localproperties.xml. Next, we're going to edit this file. Now, in this XML file, we'll only need to make a couple of minor changes. First, we'll scroll down and uncomment the Web Report Studio section by removing the uh, exclamation point dashes above and below the Web Report Studio tags. Next, we'll set the company logo to false. And then in the pro product logo text, we'll type in the value of the company name. We'll save this file and restart Tomcat. And then in the product logo text tags, we'll add the company name here. You'll notice that after Tomcat has restarted successfully, the banner at the top of each page will now say Zencoast Consulting, and the title bar at the top of the Internet Explorer browser will also say the company name. SAS BI Aug Source, you can actually type in customizations to Web Report Studio and obtain the documented directions on how to modify the SAS Web Report Studio banner.